Hey guys, welcome to a new video. In this video, we're going to be using Silly Tavern with Cobalt AI. For all those people having trouble out there with Tavern AI, this is going to be for you guys. You're going to want to try and use Silly Tavern instead of uh, Tavern AI. So let's get straight into it. The first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to head over and get the Silly Tavern download. You're going to go to code right here on the GitHub, and you're just going to go download the zip. First thing we're going to do is we're going to run the start.bat file. Okay, it wants us to extract all and run. Actually, it yeah, won't. Well, we just extract all. I'll make a folder for it on my desktop just to make it more simple for everyone. And then we'll just name it Silly Tavern. And now we're going to extract all that information into that folder. All right, great. So we've got our Silly Tavern folder on the desktop. Let's jump right into it. Okay, so I didn't have any room left on my C drive, so I just placed it inside of my D drive because I have more space there. So we're just going to run the model from right here. And so now that we have the folder extracted, we're just going to click on the start.bat file and run anyway. And this is going to start the download. Right now, all you're going to do, you should start up on this screen. You're going to click this little plug symbol. Basically, in API, we're going to be using Cobalt AI. So we'll click Cobalt AI. And for the API URL, we're going to jump back over to Cobalt. Link will be available in the description. You are going to select your model of choice and click Run. After that's done, you're going to click Show Code, and it should show you all the code that's going on. You're going to scroll down to the bottom and you're going to wait for everything to finish loading. Now that mine's finished loading, you'll get a message that will send you straight to a link. Okay, so once we're in Cobalt AI, copy this link. Go back to Silly Tavern and paste the link in there. Press connect. And there, once you have this green symbol here, you are properly connected. Okay, so now I have my character selected. You can go in here into character management and select your character. You can now talk to them. Hello. For whatever reason, the response time for this takes about 20 seconds for me usually. And you can fiddle with that a little bit. You can mess around with that with the settings. If you lower the, the amount of tokens and stuff, you can actually shorten the length of the response time. Now, I think the response time on Tavern AI is better than Silly Tavern. But if you can't get access to Tavern AI and you just have Silly Tavern, this is... A viable solution to that i've seen many people in the comments for my first video say that cloudflare isn't working for them or that they've had issues with tavern ai so this is a perfect solution for you thank you guys so much for watching the video i hope you enjoyed it it's just a quick little tutorial if you liked it hit the like button and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time bye